Darren has another name. We call him Big D. That means he has a big heart. And his exceptional dedication and commitment just keeps him aside of everybody else and he's separate. He can be commended for a series of things that I could count on him. He's somebody that can, I can count on. Um, a guy with exceptional dedication and he leads his team that way every single day. I've been at Parkway Place for 10 years. To be nominated by the great people that I work with, uh, the outstanding men and women, it, it means a lot. It means a lot to how they think of me as a, a leader, someone they can come to someone they can look up to. A conductor of crazy is what I like to call it. Uh, in the kitchen, and any chef can tell you, in the kitchen, it, it's you've got pots going, ovens at 350 degrees or higher, fryers at 350 degrees, so you gotta have to control all of that chaos, and uh, so being a leader is something that I was born into. My favorite food to prepare is the food that's gonna make someone smile. I know it's a cop-out answer, but that is my answer. It's, it's a Justice League. Uh, we have many different uh, heroes that come together and form one strong unit. Uh, I'm Batman, of course, uh, because that's, that's just the way it is, but um, Parkway Place, the leadership over the years has been an amazing group of people, and uh, I'm just really, really lucky. I'm really lucky to work with such fine men and women. When the freeze started, Darren was on vacation. Darren was not supposed to be here that Monday when we lost the power and the freeze kicked in. From nowhere, Darren showed up at 6.30 in the morning when he found out none of his staff would come to the kitchen. We asked him what happened, why you didn't go on vacation. He said, I knew the freeze was coming, so I did not leave town, and I want to stay here for the community. Darren came in opened the kitchen, fed 250 plus people, three meals a day the rest of the week, and he stayed here. Darren's leadership is a servant leadership, and you don't have to ask him, and he has no boundaries who he needs to help and where he needs to be.